My name is Jamie Hall. I am the Chief Operating Officer of SafeWork Manitoba. The Safety Culture Award really is intended to look at the entire safety and health program and culture within an organization. And so what we're doing with this award is looking for an organization that goes beyond just mere compliance and recognizes that safety is an investment in the success of the organization. So Bison was selected for this award. Uh, first and foremost, and really foundational, is they have a strong safety and health program. It was very evident from their nomination that they have a management system for safety and health, and they want to ensure that it's used well, it's running effectively, and it's functioning in all of their, uh, their workplaces. Second, it was also very evident that leadership is actively involved and what was clear in their nomination is the investment that they make, not only in money, but in time and resources into ensuring that they have a strong safety and health program. But you could also see in their nomination that there was inclusiveness, that perspectives were considered and, and people were encouraged to speak up and bring their concerns forward. There's also accountability, that we are all responsible for our own safety, but everyone around us and they have systems and programs in place that did that. Uh, and then also that, uh, that they were continuously learning and looking for ways to improve their, uh, their safety and health program. Hi, my name is Stephanie Fensom. I'm the manager of safety with Bison Transport. I think over the last couple of years, we continue to see whether it's in Manitoba or across the regions, that people are getting more engaged in safety, understanding why it's important to be safe. Right? There's policies and procedures in place to make sure everybody does make it home safely, but they're there to make it home safely. So I think people are more focused on the whys now as opposed to what they need to do to accomplish the why. And I think that's meaningful because if people understand why they're doing it and what it means to them, they're more likely to act on it. I think one of the most important things that we do to make sure our employees and contractors know that they have the ability to be safe is our right to decide policy. It gives everyone the opportunity to temporarily discontinue work if they believe that it's unsafe for any reason, without repercussion, right? We want them to identify why they believe it's unsafe so that we can act on it and correct it before they continue. I think the safety culture in Manitoba is becoming more important. I think it's getting more awareness. I think people, whether it's organizations or Safe Work Manitoba themselves, are getting more creative in how they make people think about what they're doing and why they're making the decisions. The safety is important to me because our people drive everything that we do and making sure that they're front and center in everything that we do really drives the rest of the things, right? We want to deliver freight on time, we want to make sure the trailers get offloaded and all the other transactional type things that work happen within any business, but it all starts with the people. If you put safety with the people and you make them feel empowered and that you actually do believe in them, everything else takes care of itself. We're very fortunate at Bison that our executive team absolutely believes in safety as one of our core values and it is actually a core value that we have. So it's on the walls, it's on our documentation, it's everywhere. So it really is a top-down approach where they back up everything that we put forward from a safety front and as our employees and contractors recognize that, it makes it much easier to make those safe choices. On behalf of SafeWork Manitoba, I'd like to congratulate Bison Transport on winning the 2019 Safety Culture Award.